You damn twig snappers! People are trying to sleep. Ah, the tasty smell of the start of a weenie roast. I need to get me some kielbasa and white hots. Hmm, seven letter word for long and hard starts with an A. Um, uh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh, what is this? I know this. What would be long and hard? It fits perfectly and is long and incredibly hard to pronounce. Except I feel like... Ah, two down, 65 to go. Bird man! Pant! Pant! You're half of the duplex! It burned down! Peter Potamus, you're under arrest for the arson of this guy's half a house! Harvey, help me! I didn't do it! Well, I mean, if I was going out, so I'd throw your mailbox in and keep it going a bit longer for my s'mores, but I didn't start it! Ordinarily, I turned down a case while busy with something else. But seeing how this hippo saved me in a case... I need a good lawyer, now! Hey, anybody got an extra set of trousers? Damn it, turn rip my good chinos! Save me! Yeah, sure. And even save my life... Birdman's drowning! Uh, all right, what I do? What I do? What are you... Bring 1,000! Bring 1,000! I have to. I'll take the case! Volturo. Birdman, is it not enough that you taste by having your duplex? Now you have to suffer by losing to me. Hmm. Oh, Henry. Oh, cute. An air kiss. Followed by an air fondle, air squeeze, and then finally an air... Order. Order in the courtroom. Presenting evidence. Thank you, Your Honor. Now, I would like to... Mr. Peter Potamus to the stand. Okay, don't say anything. Got it? The less you say, the better our case. Now, Mr. Potamus, if you wouldn't uh, mind, jury and the world, your total and complete guilt in this case? I am sorry. I will not admit to anything because I have a bad case of laryngitis. Therefore, I cannot talk. Good day, then. But you just... Uh, I mean, uh, this is preposterous. Uh, Your Honor, if I could, I demand the defendant admit to the crime. I demand it. Mr. Bram Bram, does your defendant have laryngitis? I think he meant to say bronchitis. Wait, that's the seven-letter word beginning with A. Yeah, what he said. You mean an inflammation of the bronchial tubes caused by excessive smoke inhalation. Laughable. No further questions, Your Honor. He did it. Yeah, Mr. Bombs over Baghdad, you're up. Ladies and gentlemen, sure, my client appears to be a callous, privileged, sticky mess of a hippo, but he is also... A person of special needs. A man on a journey through life without the aid of fingers or thumbs and therefore incapable of starting a fire. If it pleases, Your Honor, why don't we just ask someone who saw the whole thing happen? Oh. Uh, would, a, would, a, would a Mrs. Gigi Quackenbush Lopez Feinerstein David Peck Wong Birdman my tour? What? Please take the stand. Gigi! Wife, I think. What are you doing? If you would, please tell the court what you saw that fateful evening when... Of course. <sighs> Harry Birdman and I recently got back together. We're married, you know. Anyway, I was returning from my lover, 
I mean, butcher's house, when I saw a small fire on our porch. I saw that hippo just standing there with those matches in his hand. You mean that in conjunction with the book of matches found at the scene, this testimony puts Potamus on the scene with intent? Nothing further! Uh, well, uh, I think I get a cross-examination or something, right? Well, no doubt. You need to hammer down, good buddy. You are in the granny land looking for beaver. Watch for bears. Over. Um, I'll take that as a yes. You never admitted that to anyone before. And it's on record. Gigi, wife. Ugh, not while I'm under oath, Harry. I would bet that I could present something that contradicts this statement. Mm. This matchbook, found at the scene of the crime, uh, my house. Sure, looks like a matchbook to me. Don't you find it strange that my client would put his own name and phone number on the very matches he used to burn my house and leave them there for all to find? Uh, not really. He was probably going to give them to some intern. Nah, I was going to give them to Savannah over at Boobies. Aha! Uh -huh. Ixnay on the etches, May. No, I mean I was going to give them to Savannah until I saw Gigi. I gave him to her at the weenie roast at your place, Birdman. She asked for him, and I, being a gentleman, obliged. Plus, it's not like I could ever use him for that thumbs and all. So that does place Gigi at the scene of the crime with the Book of Matches. Wait, but why? Bird girl to the rescue! I found a new piece of evidence! <gasps> it's a cigarette lighter with the initials PP engraved on the side. I found it at your house, Birdman! Oh, thanks for that evidence. That's great. For the other side... A cigarette lighter with Mr. Potamus's initials on it at the scene of the conflagration. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I believe that this is what we refer to as a smoking gun. Or some people I know call it a lighter. Hmm. Something here just doesn't make sense. But how do we know that PP stands for Peter Potamus? It could stand for P the Funk Maker, Phil Febbin, or maybe even, uh... Hey, Peanut! What's your last name? Wait just one second. Why would Gigi say she saw Potamus with a book of matches? Would the witness please rephrase her testimony for the court? I can change my testimony. <laughs> 